the dream of Bangladesh reaching developed country status as portrayed in the vision 2041 will only be possible with a healthy skilled human capital in making this dream a reality the role of nutrition is fundamental Bangladesh has already made significant progress in many social sector indices such as health population nutrition education water sanitation food security and women's development now Bangladesh is advancing to attain the sustainable development goals including nutrition by 2030 all these have become possible because of the government's commitment concerted effort and multi-sectoral approach assumed by Bangladesh National Nutrition Council Nutrition has also been enshrined in Bangladesh Constitution as a fundamental principles of state policy. Our father of the nation, Bangabandhu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, established the National Nutrition Council in 1975. Among the different programs which are being administered throughout the country to promote nutrition, an important aspect is the gender equality nutrition as it has a very serious impact on physical growth, cognitive development. With this focus in mind, the National Plan of Action for Nutrition has been geared from 2016 to 2025. The multi-sectoral approach to ensure sustainable solution for improved nutrition it is required that relevant ministries incorporate nutrition components in all its targeted activities and allocate budget accordingly. The Honorable Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina has given three crucial directives that includes ensuring adequate allocation of funds for nutrition program in respective ministries, assessing human resource for nutrition services in all sectors at all levels and organizing nationwide National Nutrition Week with utmost importance. The Ministry of Health and Family Welfare is implementing a number of interventions through its 10 operational plans to achieve SDG targets. Stipend for girls and midday meal has been introduced in the schools. These steps will enhance dedication for students as well as parents towards education and also for the improvement of overall nutrition. The government's multi-sectoral approach to combat malnutrition recognized the importance of food security and the significance of nutritionally diverse agricultural production such as vegetables, fruits, fisheries and livestock. Food security has three elements or three components that we have enough food for our all people, access to food or affordability to food and also uh, nutritionally rich and balanced food. In collaboration with different organizations, including uh, Nutrition Council, we will be achieving food security, safe and nutritious food. Bangladesh is not only working nationally, but also collaborating with global partners. It is one of the early responders as nation to sign the Sun Movement. The Honorable Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina has approved the NPAN 2, that is National Plan of Action for Nutrition, for the period from 2016 to 2025. After the Government of Bangladesh has passed the National Nutrition Policy 2015. The partnership with development organizations has been instrumental in Bangladesh National Nutrition Council's work. UN and donor partners at home and abroad recognize the progress in nutrition governance that 
is essential for improving nutritional status of children and women under the revitalized leadership of Bangladesh National Nutrition Council and renewed commitment of the government. For the country to make a further dent on child malnutrition, there needs to be stronger coordination between what is called nutrition-specific interventions and the nutrition-sensitive interventions. To promote these interventions, it is necessary for Bangladesh to allocate more resources to these very important issue areas and also continue to improve their utilization. Bangladesh National Nutrition Council's role is to provide policy guidance to relevant government agencies so that they can formulate a much-needed nutrition policy for urban population. The Bangladesh National Nutrition Council has made a fantastic effort to really develop a very inclusive plan. What they have done is they have in, uh, consulted with all the different government departments and a broad section of civil society and community to really try to make a very inclusive and far-reaching plan that will help to meet the nutritional challenges of Bangladeshi citizens wherever they may be. In the last decade, Bangladesh has made considerable progress in reducing malnutrition and is lauded as a success story in Global Nutrition Fora. The Government of the People's Republic of Bangladesh and Bangladesh National Nutrition Council have already adopted and implemented various action plans to advance the multi-sectoral, multi-stakeholder and multi-level nutritional approaches. Bangladesh Nutrition Council has involved 22 ministries who work directly or indirectly for nutrition causes. They have placed their 10-year work plan and that is to be implemented by their own budget. And the other thing is that all the ministries were lacking of the human resources and their need has been assessed. And every year from 23rd to 29th April, National Nutrition Week is being observed throughout the country. Not only the government ministries or the sectors, rather all the development partners, UN bodies, NGOs, INGOs, civil society organizations, particularly the people for whom we do work, their participation is a mandatory and we do believe with their all sorts of cooperation we shall achieve our goal. The government's political pledge to improve nutritional status of children, adolescents and women is commendable and it is reflected in its revived national and sub-national level coordination mechanism with multiple key ministries, reinvigorated partnership with civil societies and development partners. In 1972, the father of the nation, Bongabundu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, had a dream of building a healthy nation. Honorable Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina, his worthy daughter, has expressed her deep commitment to realize that dream. To make her pledge a reality, Bangladesh National Nutrition Council is working round the clock.